hey guys welcome back to another vlog welcome back to another video in today's video guys we're gonna be taking malika to our usual um checkup dietitian physiotherapy stuff like that we haven't really taken you guys on one of these appointments before so we're taking you guys with us today right we also have a number of other stuff lined up for today we're gonna be trading in some bottles and we're gonna be checking out a new spin studio so you guys don't want to miss that we're a little bit late so we're running into this appointment come along guys Got it? <laughs> Malia, remember best behavior. You all right? Mm -hmm. Talk to somebody? Yeah. No iPad, baby. Use the iPad to the, or the lamp up. This way, Malika. This way. In. 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 Oh, careful. Go play with the toys, Malia. No big chip. No homework. No homework. No homework. Okay, I, I didn't even know that we had homework. It's okay. It was two days ago. We're kind of like fast tracking through this stuff. Mm -hmm. It's really to give you an idea of some information. Malika, put on your shoes. Hey, <laughs> take those shoes off. Off is more comfortable. Okay, <laughs> little girl. Shoes off. I think Malia was better. Malia, you got your knife? Yeah. <laughs> okay. What are you cooking today? <laughs> are you cooking rice? No. What are you cooking today? Chicken? No. Carrots? No. Corn? I know what she's cooking. She's cooking porridge. Mmm. No. Mmm, <laughs> yum. Okay. So, um, let's say she was saying, so this is what she would be doing. She'd be going, oh, play. Play. Uh -huh. Is playtime in here as a single one? The, is playtime there? Play is there and time, and then time is, is here. Somewhere. Uh, time. Time. I'm just gonna search to see if playtime is it. She didn't it do the full, the full. Should it play and then time? Yeah, because Ooh. this is the full version of it, where she will do the, the words at the front and the back. But oh, normally she's okay. change it and put okay. just the one section. Gotcha. Where it's just playtime. The other communication apps out mm. there, yeah. for a few reasons. One being. You never have to hit more than three times for it to say the word. Okay. Some of the other apps, it's like 16 times you have to Ooh. push things before you get to the word that it says. Mm -hmm. That's too much. I'm mm -hmm. losing interest just thinking about so, that. So, right? for example, say I go to work. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to work, right? Hey, bye, Malika. I'm going to work. So mm -hmm. I probably it to work. Is there like, oh, there's other things in that section. Like, if I it to work, there's more words in there. Well, that one just said to work, so that one doesn't go okay. beyond. Um, so, on here, most of these ones will open up to more words, mm -hmm. except these green ones right here, these blue ones, and these orange ones. Okay. Those are some of the only, like, one-hit mm -hmm. words on the system. Okay. Okay? Um, I have, no, but I didn't have cover. Yeah. <laughs> okay. The other, the yellow background, mm -hmm. those are your pronouns. Okay. Um, so these ones... Come, Bumala, you have to eat food, no. and then you get candy. No, mommy, eat food. <laughs> okay. Eat yes, guys, so that was just a quick course on, like, a language app that we've been using with Malika. It's called LAMP. 
Um, that's one of the things about living here, man. Like the access to resources that we would not have in Jamaica. Would you have had this in Jamaica? No, not at all. I can't, yeah, up to First of all, I want to get an iPad. <laughs> <laughs> that was paid for, that was given to us. That was given to us, Monica. Sit down, man. Put on your seatbelt. Yeah. So, um, the name of the app is LAMP and it's a communication app that helps um, persons with special needs to communicate or non-verbal persons to communicate. So, we've been using this for a couple months now. It's been in our school, she's been doing it at school, but we are just learning to use it so we can use it at home as well. So, that's the appointment that we're just coming from. Now, we're going home. We have some bottles that we're going to trade out. As you guys know, you can trade your plastic bottles, juice, containers. For cash, right? So we're gonna go and do that right now. Show me life, show me love, make a change. Time is up. We can wait for better days, but the days won't come. Show me life, show me love, show me life, show me love, make a change. Time is up We can wait for better days But the days won't come Show me life Yes guys, welcome to the garage So these are all bottles that we're gonna be trading out right now For cash Quite a few Put these in the car right now I see how much cash we can get for it Yes, guys, so we have five and a half bottles here, most of which is Peter Shore. <laughs> um, this is probably two months worth of bottles, a month and a half. But we'll do this pretty often. Um, this amount of bottles will probably get me like $50, um, typically. But let's see, sometimes we fluctuate, I don't know. I don't know what they use as a metric, but sometimes it's up and down, right? So we're gonna go to the Bottle Depot and get these guys traded out. That was a, a struggle to fit everything in, but we got it done. So while I wait on this, I'm going to go and check the mailbox. So we have a community mailbox so that the mail person don't have to be going door to door in this community and quite a few communities. So the mailbox is just across the street right there. I have my mailbox key. going to see if we got any mail. And that's the mailbox right there. So probably a 20 second walk. Let's see if we got any mail. I am expecting a package. And that is always expecting packages. <laughs> Beautiful day today. Sky is nice and blue. Not too hot. Perfect weather. Yeah. So no packages yet, guys. I think we have to wait until probably next week. Nothing but coupon in the mailbox. Such a nice day today. This is our little nice community. Malika, leave the button. <laughs> Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Never figure out where the road goes Even if I'm far 
going down I will keep on searching for my heights You can say I lost my mind Yes guys, so I ended up getting $76 Not bad, 5 bags a bottle $76 Come on now, can't complain Can't complain at all guys I'm um, true spin Yeah so we have one more um, stop on our list of things to do today, guys. We are going to a spin studio. If you guys don't know what a spin studio is, it's um, one of those cycling studios. So a friend of ours actually kick off our business. We're gonna go there and see what's going on. And you know, show the world what True Spin, is that the name? Yeah, I think it's called True Spin, but Kirsten, coming to see you shortly. Yes guys, welcome to the streets of Grand Prairie. So, we're in the back alley right now. We're gonna go around to the front. Everybody good? So, True Grit Spin. Is that, did I get it right? <laughs> yeah, True Grit Spin Studio. So tell me a little bit, what is True Grit Spin Studio? Um, it's an indoor cycling studio, a beat-based ride. Um, it's all about community, connection, friendship, and equality <laughs> workout. Thank you. Well, you <laughs> yeah. Is there anything like this right now in Grand Prairie? Um, I think so, like orange is similar, but um, we're gonna do things different Differently. here. So. Fantastic. So you're just getting your space together. Yeah. So this Showers is. Showers are getting put in. So for persons who don't know what a spin studio is, okay. it's really cycling, right? It's like, how close are you? <laughs> not, not that close. Don't worry. It's pretty distant, yeah. Um, you can tell I love the camera. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, so for somebody that's never been to a ride, um, you would come in, you would sign up. We do beginner's classes. Our instructors will go over the bikes with you. Um, so we'll help set up your bike. It's a stationary bike. So you ride, but okay. you don't go anywhere. Yeah. So let's ride our hearts out. So is it one of those places <laughs> that you get like music pumping and you're like yeah. riding? And... Yeah, so the room is all black, painted black. Well, it mm -hmm. will be. <laughs> and uh, there's fans, air purifiers, dehumidifiers, a mirror at the front for your form. Mm. Um, yeah. For your form? Form, on what, the bike. What form do you need to ride a bike? You just need to ride a bike, come on. <laughs> Get all well, you're out of the saddle, <laughs> mm -hmm. so you want to make sure your shoulders are back, mm. that you're able to, your airway is open, so you're holding onto those handlebars, your hips are back, your seat. Um, okay. Oh, booty's allowed to see, I can't even talk. So, so your booty has to be allowed <laughs> to see. right? <laughs> <laughs> so, question though is, um, for, like, this is cardio. Yes. Fitness. Yeah. And is, it's this, is this something you've always been interested in, or what made you want to do a business like no. this? No, not at all. So I'm actually a dirt biker at heart. So okay. love dirt biking. My girlfriend made me come to a spin class. Mm. It was in a gym. I hated it. Uh. I said I would never go back. I was like, ooh, I'll never do spin again. No, mm -hmm. thank you. It was in a glass room. Gotcha. Everybody could see us. 
Like uh, I was dying yeah, a thousand just deaths. Past us oh, it was eyes. it was bad. Yeah, and it was yeah. like a little boombox, and I was just like, I just remember dying and like seeing people walk by and stare at me, and I'm like, yeah. oh. Oh, so yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was gone, and I went to school for my motorcycle and power equipment mm -hmm. mechanics. Okay. Um, from there, I started like studying on the bike. So okay. at school, they had a screen, and I would ride the bike, study, mm -hmm. and whatnot. And then when I moved back and got a job somebody was opening a spin studio that I know from back home gotcha and she's like if you come you get a free Lululemon shirt hmm. and I'm like okay okay oh, twist, twist my rubber shirt. arm for the Lululemon yeah. so I went to the class and it was completely different yeah it was in a dark room it was like it was the vibe the music the lights um, the energy in the room that the instructor mm -hmm. created by motivating us and I was okay. like oh my god I love this yeah this is what spin is. Okay. Fantastic. <laughs> so. so we're here at Grand Prairie, Alberta. If you guys are from Grand Prairie, the studio will be located right across the street from those lovely businesses right there. So this gives you an idea of where it is. Centrally located in the middle of downtown. So I find this very, very convenient. But parking in the back. Parking in the back. Okay, we don't want to miss that. As you guys see, we have to walk around here. <laughs> parking, in the, parking in the back. Now tell me, is it gonna be like 24 hours or what's the hours? No, are we so we'll be open for classes. So my, you'll be able to book on my website. I'll also have an app, which is getting made right now by Mariana Tech. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, you'll be able to book your bike. You actually get to pick your spot, which Sweet. is pretty amazing. So there'll be a little spreadsheet and you can say like, I want bike three. Oh, so. Or, you know, maybe you want one by a fan. So do you like drop-ins <laughs> or do you have to have like a membership? Um, Drop-in, punch pass, membership, gotcha. all of those things. So. Fantastic. Okay, let's take a look around the studio. It's unfinished right now, guys, but just so you guys... <laughs> and the bikes are already packed out yet? Well, the bikes are in here. Yeah, let's... My, the one I built was at home right here. Oh, the bikes are in the box, Dale. The bikes are in the box. Well, this is where it's um, going to be, pretty much. No, no. Okay. This is this is just like my um, locker room and whatnot, mm -hmm. um, and that type of thing. So this is, I didn't want drywall on the bikes. Yeah. So um, this is actually the spin room, if we go over here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is the spin room. This one. And here's the stage. <laughs> so you have a stage. What's yeah. the stage for? Um, for the instructor to be on, so they'll be on, they'll be at the front of class, so that'll actually be the front of class. Okay. Um, speakers on either side, and then, yeah, the instructor will be on here, the podium to mm -hmm. control the lights and the fans and everything. Okay. Um, I made the stage big enough so that we can have team teaches, so two okay. bikes can fit on there, so you get two instructors Fantastic. on there. Fantastic. I can tell you're really excited. I am. <laughs> yeah? This has been in the making now for a couple months now. Um... It's been under construction for a bit. There was a couple holdups, but that's to be expected. Mm -hmm. That's business. So but, let, let's ask a totally unrelated question. Yeah. So for persons watching this and wants to know who's Kirsten, um, you are from BC initially. Yeah, I'm from BC. I'm actually born and raised in a small town called Princeton. Mm -hmm. So if you know about the Princeton, Hope Princeton Highway, if you blink, you miss. Princeton, uh, that's how small it is. You better not blink. <laughs> but so what brought you to Grand Prairie? How long have you been in Grand Prairie? Um, I've been in Grand Prairie, it'll be two years in October, mm -hmm. and my partner is actually here. Okay. So that's what brought me. Um uh, what here. do you like about Grand Prairie so? Um what do you like about Grand Prairie so far? Um Oh, good question. <laughs> I do miss the mountains from home, but I am um, enjoying the hiking groups okay. that I have joined with a yeah. couple of ladies. Um, I'm enjoying the community. So like M3M's mixers, like gotcha. I've gained a lot of friendships um, mm -hmm. through this community, which I'm happy about. Happy about. <laughs> okay, so do you have a launch date for your studio? Or what are you aiming for? It'll be in September, but no, not a hundred percent on the date yet. Okay. But very close to announcing it on Instagram. So is it gonna be like a <laughs> wine and cheese lunch, or is it gonna be like just the doors open, come on in? Are you are you planning a lunch party and thing like that? Um, I'm gonna have like a big like grand opening yeah. day, and I'll have I'll be cross promoting with other vendors and mm -hmm. things like that. And okay. yeah, yeah. Sweet. Well, sign me up. Sign you up. Uh, I'm on my fitness journey. Maybe myself, I'll get you so. teaching at some point. I'm thinking about it actually. I saw your ads and I'm like, you I know like what? It. That's something that I probably do because I'm on my own fitness journey right now. Yeah. And like, 
I'm a lot fitter than I look right now, so yeah. I definitely do it. Yeah. Well, you are looking for instructors. Are I you am still looking, looking for instructors. What I are, have what are your, a few, but... What are your qualifying factors? What are you looking for? Um, It's more, for me, I'm not... If they're certified, amazing in group fit, fitness or spin, but like we can get you certified. We can get you to that point of teaching. Okay. It's more about your personality, your core values. Like I want somebody that is about community, somebody mm -hmm. that is about connection, that enjoys oh, helping people and leads I'm with motivated. kindness. I'm motivated. You can do it. You yeah. can do it. Yeah. You, you are slacking off. Pedal, pedal, pedal to the metal. Gotcha. Definitely everybody <laughs> brings their own flavor to their spin class for sure. So. Absolutely. I'm well, an energetic drill sergeant, so. I can tell. I can tell. You're always high energy. Do you drink a lot of coffee, baby? No. No. No, it's good. my ADHD. Oh, well, you and me both. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Well, we're really excited for you, and um, we know your journey from, you know, we're, we've, we've spoken before yep. about your studio and your dream and your goals, and just so get it done. This will actually be where you come into the studio room right there. Oh. So yeah. you come in at the front. You come at the front, go through the locker room area where the bikes were. Mm -hmm. And then... So what are the other areas going to be? Sorry? Are you going to use the other spaces for something else? Yeah, it'll be stretch and bar. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, and then this will be like locker room. Locker room, oh, gotcha. Lunching, connection mm -hmm. room kind of idea. And then through here, the water bottle filling station will be over here. Okay. Um... And then here is our washrooms. Okay. Keep washroom clean during construction. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. And then our showers. Um, and that's one of the things I'm super excited about because um, I like the privacy aspect of it. So yeah. this will actually have a door on it, and you can come in here, get changed, shower, and come get or pretend dressed to shower. before you come out. So. You can pretend to shower too. And that's okay. Oh, I can. Okay. You don't have to actually shower. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is nice. I like it. Are you excited to get started in your spin classes? Yes, I am. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> Do you have prices yet or not? Um, not yet. I haven't not launched yet. them yet because okay. I'm working on that with my um. Mama. Yeah, mama. I understand that. That's why I, did. I didn't bring it up because mama. I know that that's probably at the end stage. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, you don't want to undercharge, you don't want to overcharge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, the bikes are expensive. <laughs> Yo, I can only imagine. I was going to try to get here earlier to build you one so that there was one sitting there. But... That's okay, I'll come up when everything is up and running. Um, do you plan on doing you any... this, right? Yes, guys, so you guys are looking at the newest spin instructors in Grand Prairie. <laughs> So guys, as you know, we've been on our own fitness journey, so we have just been voluntold that we're going to be teaching spin, which we're going to take on because I don't know, we don't back down from a challenge, right? No, we don't. We don't back down from a challenge. So we're going to be doing that. So just a quick update on my own fitness journey. You guys are maybe wondering what's going on. It's day 42. Malika, come on. It's day 42, guys. Been consistently going to the gym. Diet up and running. I've lost, I'd say, 17 pounds when I checked the scale last. So things are going on. And of course, I always use this as an opportunity to let you guys know that it's never too late to start your own fitness journey. Health is wealth, right? Whatever it looks like for you. It's your pace. It's not anybody else's pace. So get up off that couch, guys. Get up, get up, get up. And go and get it. All right? We're in the street, so it's very noisy. So I'm gonna end the vlog right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys haven't already subscribed, please take a second to subscribe to our channel, smash a like on this video, and leave a comment. All right, guys? See you guys in the next video.